All right, guys, so we've just arrived at camp. Beautiful little spot about three hours north of where I live in Victoria. I'm gonna come and show you my campsite, and then I'm gonna show you my little camping gear, my little CPAP camp setup. So there's the rig. You can see, if you wanna follow us on Instagram, that's our little traveling family page, Wonderl Australia. This is our van. We actually took this van right around Australia. So that 36, 37,000 kilometers. Here, Sarah, I won't get too close. There's little bubs on the boob. <laughs> this is where I keep my daughter in a little cage <laughs> just so she doesn't get out. Uh, some people have cats and dogs. I've got kids. <laughs> and uh, I'll just show you my little van. So it's a bit messy because we just got here, but here's the workbench. Here's the young fella. Little, little mate Zach, he's got his little bunk bed. And what do you got here, mate? A few toys? Oh, he's, he's saying goodbye. Okay, and there's Haley's little bunk bed. All right, come out here and I'll just show you this beautiful part of the world. So Victoria is just simply beautiful, especially if you get days like today. Balmy 30 degrees, plenty of bush, no one in sight. Just beautiful scenery. You don't need a whole lot. That water is absolutely beautiful too. It's not too cold. It's actually coming down from a dam. Alrighty. Oh, how good is this, huh? This is the best place I've ever done a video before, that's for sure. Okay, so in this bag here is basically everything you will need if you're going camping. And you want to be able to use your CPAP machine without having access to a PowerPoint, which means you can get away to those really remote locations that we all want to get to just like this one here away from the crowds and you can still get a really nice you know, peaceful quiet night's sleep wake up feeling good uh, without wake up the campsite obviously as well so let's open up the bag and i'll show you exactly what we have in it so everything sort of fits in here you can sort of see that there all fits nice and neatly into the little bag here so the first thing is this little Medistrom Pilot Light battery. This is the 12 volt version. This is the battery I was charging when I was driving here. So it was a three hour drive. The battery was virtually flat when I left and it's fully charged now. And it's gonna last for a couple of nights. So when I'm ready for bed tonight, I will just plug my machine into here and it's gonna run the machine for close to two nights. So I probably won't have to charge this because we're only here for two nights. But if I do need to give it a little top up, I do have here my little 12 volt charger. So as long as I've got like a 12 volt cigarette jack, like in the car or the caravan, I can plug that in, charge the battery up and it's gonna be fully charged again from flat to full in about three hours, which is pretty awesome. I can also use, if I want to, I don't need to this time, like a solar panel. So this is just like a little fold out solar panel. And I can throw that in the sun, as long as I've got reasonable sunlight, I can charge that battery system up about six to eight hours from flat to full. Uh, the next thing, obviously, my little Z2 Auto. I've taken this machine all around Australia. It's never missed a beat, and I just love it to bits because it's just purpose-built for travel. It's so small, so lightweight. Now, you can pack it up super easy, but the best thing about it is, you know, it just works really well with these things, which is exactly what you want if you're camping or caravanning, hey? And then the next thing is my this is a new mask. This is called a P2H from BMC. They make great little masks, really affordable. In this little section here, we have this little thing. Now what that is, it's called a HME filter, heat moisture exchange filter. And because the travel machines don't actually have humidification systems, this heat moisture filter acts like a humidifier. It actually uses the moisture in our own breathing to create that humidification. And it just takes the edge off the dryness of the CPAP therapy so that you don't wake up, you know, with that really dry throat. Works a treat. Um, so I'll be using that. All I'm gonna be doing is just connecting up the tubing, grab my little battery pack, which is now fully charged. This is just a little DC cable, yellow end. It's got a little yellow end, just goes in that DC output. The other end just goes in the machine. That's good to go. It's got power to it now, so it's ready to go. And all I'm gonna do is just 
mask over the head, I may as well just do it. Mask over the head. Start breathing. We're on. That's on. And we're good to go. How good is that, huh? Honestly, just the, the best little setup and super affordable. So you can literally pick up all this gear here for around the sort of $1,300, $1,400 mark. The next best model down from the Z2 is the ResMed Air Mini. And to put that in perspective, the Air Mini, which retails at about $2,200 for the machine, that doesn't come with anything like that. You know, it doesn't come with the battery, it doesn't come with any of these DC cables, the chargers, anything like that. So it really is just a, a super awesome value package and just ridiculously popular. All right, so look, it's getting on a little bit. I thought I'd quickly just jump in the van and show you how I've set up my machine for tonight. Here's the little battery system. My machine, I have it mounted. All I've just got here is just some Velcro. And I just literally, whoop. And obviously this is the DC cable running into it. Now, because this machine has automatic on, automatic off, I can literally sort of just jump into bed, which I'll do in a second, put my mask on, start breathing, and it'll start up. And if I need to sort of get up or do anything, I can just take the mask off and it'll also stop. But that's just a cool little setup. Now, the reason I've got it sort of mounted down here and sort of not somewhere up here is because, because these are, at the end of the day, an air pump, you kind of don't want them exactly right next to your head. Alrighty, just bear with me a sec. <laughs> That's odd, okay? You can hear that. So that's odd, so I can literally just sort of, yeah, have a night tie, just sort of. And that's it, so, you know, that'll keep the missus happy tonight. <laughs> and it means tomorrow I'll, I'll wake up nice and fresh, have plenty of energy. Anyway guys, look, I'll leave it at that. I just wanted to quickly run you through my setup. Uh, make sure you check out the Z2. It's definitely the best travel CPAP machine I've come across and I just love everything about it. So if you're into your caravanning and your camping, make sure you check it out. All right, uh, take care guys. All the best on your travels and I'll see you soon, bye. Wait.